In this video, I will show you how to create an account for your Toyota, which then you can use to access important information about your car, as well as Toyota's app with various tools and services. So let's get started. Go to Google and search my Toyota. Based on your country, you should find the link to sign up to my Toyota. So click on the link and then click on I don't have an account here. Fill in your details and create a password. To be able to sign up, you would need to agree to the terms and conditions as well as the privacy statements. You might also have to prove you're not a robot. And then click on sign up to finish the registration. Then you should get an email from Toyota to activate your account. You can click on it to activate it or copy and paste the link to any browser you like and you should get your account activated. Then click on go to sign in enter your email and password and then click on login if you already got a Toyota car then you should click on owned in here then click on add a car then click on add your Toyota enter your VIN number or your license plate and then click on look up if your car detail is correct then click on yes this is my car in this way you can see your VIN number as well in the future if you logged in into your account and you want to find your car's detail then you need to click on my vehicle and then click on owned and then if you click on here, you can expand the details of your car. You won't be able to access all these tools unless you verify your vehicle. So click on verify vehicle. Depending on your country, you might have to enter different code in here. In the UK, you need to enter the version code and you should just enter the first part of that version code in here and select the date of acquisition. If your car is really old, then you need to keep clicking until you get to the date when you purchased the car and then click on confirm. If the details are correct, then you should get a message saying ownership verified now you should be able to access more details about your car such as vehicle service history you could also set up reminders by clicking on my reminders here is the full list of reminders that you can add and one of the most useful things you can access is the owner's manual click on owner's manual and then select your car's owner's manual and in this way you could always access your car's manual online now if you go to play store or app store and search for my t then you should be able to find the toyota app so install it open it a few of the things you can do using this app since we have created an account you can simply enter your email id and password and then tap on login to enter and then if you tap on here you can see all the things you could do using this app one additional thing is the warning lights so if you select that and then if your car shows any of these warning lights you can come in here select them and see what does it means and then take appropriate action you could also select car calendar which is same as the reminder and here you can add different important events for your car in the calendar and then if you select service and maintenance you can book an appointment such as MOT feel free to explore this app further to learn more about it if you have any questions or is there anything that you wished i would have mentioned in this video please let me know in the comments below